friends today we are going to see how to install a latest version of magento 2.3.5 hash p1 okay and we will also going to see what's the new features and functionality in this latest version of magento 2.3.5 okay so first open your browser and let's type in the google search engine for a website called tech1.in okay we will check with this link as you see in the screen tech1.in just click on that after the site is open tech1.in you will see in the bottom there is called installation of latest magento 2.3.5 using composer okay let's check with it and what's the new features also we will check in this point There are many new features are came in this Magento 2.3.5. We will check that also. Okay, so that's it. We came to a landing page now of the installation of Magento 2.3.5. So, to coming back to this tutorial, we will see and we will do. practically step by step regarding how to install this magento 2.3.5 using composer and what's new in magento 2.3.5 p1 which makes the magento robust and faster before going to installation we will talk regarding what update and new in magento 2.3.5 p1 In step 1 we will see compatibility magento module that have built to be decoupled from magento commerce core release process this allows us to release iterations of this modules faster to merchant who are willing to accept a little risk in exchange for earlier access to new features Following table shows the release status of Magento extension versions relative to Magento Commerce. As you see, there is a dot which colored in green, orange, and gray. Green color represent supported version. That means it has fully tested by Magento and is supported. Second one is orange compatible version that is confirmed to be compatible with Magento but is not supported. And last and final nothing but gray in color dot which is not supported for the version that means is not compatible with Magento release. So the new features which has already available from magento 2.3.0 our first one is we will call amazon sales channel as you see their updates are from they are updating 2.0.0 3.0 3.01 3 .0, and lastly is 4.0.0 we will see i have already marked in red color box the magento 2.3.5 has p1 is supported for amazon sales channel which is updated 4.0.0 okay in next step where which new feature which is came in magento 2.3 is magento inventory which is now uh updated version is 1.1.5 which is all, only available and supported for magento 2.3.5 
this is the new feature which is updated Magento inventory for 2.3.5 which is fully supported and compatible also. Next one the page builder which is 1.3.1 version as you see marked in red color box which is fully supported for Magento 2.3.5. 5p1 okay so these are the new features which are came in magento 2.3.5 which makes the magento robust and strong due to these features and compatibility and supportable the every functionality works smoothly these are the point which get updated in magento 2.3.5 which makes Magento more robust and fast, helps in easy to handle and earn money, more money due to this updated feature. Now move toward the installation part of Magento 2.3.5 P1. Okay, so check with the installation of Composer. To check the Composer installation, first you check on your local machine local system by typing the composer in your command prompt or get bash suppose i am showing over here the example i am typing composer okay composer we will see as i have already installed my local on my local machine composer it will look like this as you see the composer version is 1.8.5 okay this way you can check whether you uh, in your system is composer is uh, there or not because we are going to install the magento 2.3.5 via composer only if nothing display you will face any error please install the composer okay by going on the site called getcomposer.org download in there you will see the download and run composer.setup.exe file okay click on that then setup uh, file going to be downloaded on your local machine and run that setup folder after that the composer will going to be install your local machine and just type the composer uh, in your command prompt or git bash to check whether the composer is installed or not in the next step we will see how to download the magento 2.3.5 okay run the following command in your root directory okay as suppose uh, uh, on my local machine ZAMP is installed so I am going to show you where actually the ZAMP or my Magento folder going to be installed in your C drive you will see here is the ZAMP because ZAMP is already installed my local machine and we are seeing how to install that Magento 2.3.5 on local system using ZAMP via composer okay so this is the ht docs here uh, the magento going to be installed and how it going to be installed we will see to install this magento 2.3.5 via composer just run the following command in the root directory so copy this command and just paste into your command prompt or a git bash here it is showing the install directory name here you have to give in which folder you have to install this latest version of magento 2.3.5 p1 so i have given here example also in magento 2.3.5 is the folder name in which my all the files and folders of magento going to be installed so just copy this command okay and just paste into your command prompt or a git bash okay i am going to paste this command 
in my XAMPP STDocs folder. Okay, just I am pasting over here and enter just so downloading of all the Magento folder it's going to be started. Okay, it's take time so be patient on it. I will pause this video after the completion of the all downloading of Magento 2.0 3.5 is completed we will move toward the next process okay as we see uh, in the browser screen see the installations of all the files and folder from the Magento site is in a process and it takes a time to install all these files and folder for time being now I am just pausing the video after it's get completed we will move to further step finally uh, the download part of the Magento 2.3.5 uh, is done process is done now I have entered into the Magento 2.3.5 folder where the all files and folder get installed now the main and important step is come in the step 4 we will create a database into the PHP my admin okay See, create an empty database to work with MySQL in case you have already corrected with the permission you can use via composer also or directly add to the add a database to your PHP my admin section so open with the uh, PHP my admin section okay there we will going to add a php my ad, uh, in the php my admin we will add a database name okay so click here on the database and just add magento 2. Point. magento 235 okay i have added here magento 235 as a database name okay directly you can also add here directly now in the step 5 here it is uh, we going to install now magento 235 so to install the magento 2.3.5 we have to run this command which is below given that is php bin magento setup install this command we have to execute in your git bash or command prompt in that section it is given the options which are base url db host db name db user db password db first name admin first name last name email user password all this detail we uh, details we have to add and execute this command so here i have given the example over here according to which see i have created the magento 235 folder so base url my will be localhost magento 235 and localhost db host name is localhost and just now i have added uh, in the db name magento 235 so here you have to add the database name so now guys we are going to execute this command uh, into the command prompt or git bash ok just I am copy this command and go to the uh, in the magento 2.3.5 folder and paste that command and just enter it it takes few more time to install the magento 235 so I am pausing this video uh, after the installation is done we move toward 
another process okay so finally we done with the installation part of the magento 2.3.5 okay now we move towards step 6 in step 6 we test and see the result by running the following command so we going to execute the command called indexer reindex after that setup upgrade then setup static content deploy then cache plus so i am going to execute this command in my git bash or you can execute this command in command prompt okay so after going to executing this command we will move toward further process so finally we done with the all executions of command okay now our last and the final step to check means uh, after execution of this command we have to check into the browser the result by entering the domain whatever your folder name in my uh, section it is magento 2.3.5 so i am going to execute this copy and going to paste over here enter and for admin I'm going to paste slash admin okay so let's check so finally done with the installation see it is the front section of the magento 2.3.5 p1 and this is the admin section just now we going to log in okay it's uh, username is admin and password i am typing here see we finally log into the admin panel uh, it's a screen appear over here we will allow it okay and if you see in the downward section see oh great that's nice so finally we're done with the installation and uh, downloading of magento 2.3.5 that is the latest version okay friends so if you have any query please comment below i will surely going to answer you and please like and subscribe my channel to getting latest video on regarding new features of magento okay thanks thanks and have a nice day bye